Hey YouTube, it's ICU, and today I want to discuss something definitely important in the world of jailbreaking with you guys, the upcoming iOS 8.4 firmware, its release, and a potential new jailbreak exploit. <laughs> All right, and before we begin, a few quick things. For those of you interested in winning a brand new Apple Watch, be sure to stick around to the end of this video for instructions on how to enter my giveaway, which is actually concluding this week. Also, for a quick summary, no, there's not a new jailbreak utility. We're mostly going to be discussing iOS 8.4's release date, as stated down below in the title of this video, as well as a potential new exploit that could be used in a jailbreak. So with that said, let's go ahead and get started here by opening up Safari. So with Apple's annual worldwide Developers Conference, WWDC for short, rapidly approaching, a number of questions are undoubtedly surging through jailbreakers' minds as each day passes without a new jailbreak solution for iOS 8.3, the current public firmware. However, as I've outlined a number of times throughout my videos, I will actually have links in both card and annotation form on the screen now to my playlist, iOS 8.3 isn't necessarily the target of the next jailbreak utility. Instead, it will be jailbroken by extension with the release of a new tool capable of jailbreaking iOS 8.4, the successor to iOS 8.3. So having grasped that concept, when will iOS 8.4 make its grand appearance in the form of a public release? Now that's a great question. With the latest iOS 8.4, for beta firmware being 8.4 beta 3 having been seeded to developers over three weeks ago now on May 11th 2015 we won't receive another beta iteration of the firmware prior to its inevitable release today let's ponder said release and delve into possible iOS 8.4 release dates so that we'll have a better understanding of when a new jailbreak utility for iOS 8.4 will be issued that's also capable of jailbreaking iOS 8.1.3 8.2 and 8.3 the three firmwares that have included Apple's Taiji jailbreak patching remedy. Also, there's a slight possibility that a new vulnerability was discovered that's capable of being exploited for the intent of implementation into a jailbreak utility for iOS 8.4. However, the chances are slim considering its source. Now to preface, it's important to understand that the next jailbreak is heavily contingent upon iOS 8.4 as the firmware will be the last substantial iOS 8 update excluding any potential 8.4 x releases for example 8.4.1 or 8.4.2 prior to ios 9's public availability this fall so starting with ios 8.4's release date initially we suspected the firmware would be released to the masses following wwdc and that apple's focus was heavily set on the conference and preparing ios 9 for release to developers on june 8th 2015, which is actually this coming Monday. However, in light of the recently uncovered banner notification vulnerability that I created a video on that causes a crash on a system-wide level, unfortunately though it can't be implemented into a jailbreak, said release may have been expedited. Now while the idea of a potential iOS 8.3.1 release to correct this was tossed around, Apple ultimately opted to bake their fix directly into iOS 8.4, thus spurring theories that 8.4 would be rushed to remedy the annoying complication which anyone can trigger simply by sending a text or iMessage to any device running any version of iOS 8. Unfortunately though, unless iOS 8.4 is released this Friday, June 5th, which it may very well be, unless Apple engineers are too preoccupied with iOS 9 Beta 1, the firmware won't see the light of day until after the conference this coming Monday. Whichever way you look at it though, it's safe to say that iOS 8.4 is expected within the next week, two weeks, if additional testing is required on Apple's part. Now as for writing what Taiji and Pangu have in development for iOS 8.4 and issuing the next jailbreak, looking back to iOS 8.1.1, it took Taiji approximately two weeks to release their jailbreak for the firmware, which patched the previous Pangu iOS 8 jailbreak. So expect a similar release timeframe for iOS 8.4. Also, it's paramount to mention that while both teams are still confirmed to be actively creating new jailbreak tools, either or both 
could still opt to wait. Though the chances of that are slim, they do still exist, and as is the way of life, unexpected obstacles could unquestionably present themselves. Now moving beyond that bleak, albeit very slim possibility, a user posted the following message on Twitter, stating that he may have uncovered a vulnerability for jailbreak exploitation in iOS 8.4 Beta 2, leader of the quantum world-renowned chronic dev team Posix Ninja stated that it quote looks like zero day previously undisclosed exploits that are released before the publication of the vulnerability that led to said exploit to me to which pod 2g of the evaders jokingly replied quote maybe negative one day. Now, without analyzing it too much, while it's highly unlikely that this could mean anything substantial to the jailbreak community, the possibility does still exist, and it's exciting to say the least. Now, to be updated more often, such as if anything actually comes of this potential new vulnerability, as well as to be notified when iOS 8.4 is released, be sure to click that subscribe button down below next to my channel name if you have yet to, and to be entered to win a brand new Apple Watch, all you have to do is navigate to free appsfast.com inside of mobile safari and sign up. Once you do, come back to this video, rate it up, and leave a relevant comment down below in the comment section containing your referral code, which is the piece that appears in the fourth tab down below there after the equals symbol inside of the link itself. Now, I hope you guys like this video and I hope you found the information in it useful. Just some new details on 8.4 and a potential iOS 8.4 jailbreak vulnerability. And of course, for even more updates, just be sure to like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. And until next time. This is ICU, signing out.